welcome to in 5 minutes now we'll discuss next category of operators that is relational operators as the name suggests these operators check the relation between two operands that is two expressions or two variables and result into true or false that is these operators check whether the relation mentioned in the expression is true or false and accordingly result answer as yes or no that is true or false Let's see simple example. Less than symbol checks for whether left value is less than equal to less than the right hand value. For example, if we write x less than y, now this can generate only two kind of answers. That is, if x less than y, this will generate answer as true. That is one. If x less than y is not true, that is, if x is not less than y, the answer will be false. That is zero. So these are the relational operators. They check the relation between two values and generate the answer as either true or false, which is nothing but one or zero in case of C. Following relational operators, less than, less than or equal to, then there is greater than, greater than or equal to, then there is not equal to, and there is equal to. Not equal to written as exclamation equal to together. not equal to written as exclamation equal to together and equal to there is comparison is written in as two double equal to symbols that is equal to operator <coughs> now these two last are also called as equality operators because they check the equality of the two values now let's see how these operators work they are really very simple to understand. Let's say a is 5, b is 10, and c is 2. Now, a simple expression can be like a less than b. This expression result into true or false according to whether a is less than b. Now, in our case, since a less than b is correct, answer will be 2, that is 1. Now, we write, suppose c is, let's say, b upon a c is not equal to b upon a now in this expression c is 2 and b upon a is also 2 so 2 not equal to 2 is actually false that is answer is 0 we can check some somewhat like a mod 2 is not equal to 0 now a mod 2 is 5 mod 2 answer is 1 and not equal to 0 that is 1 not equal to 0 is 2 hence the answer will be 2 that is answer is 1 so that is how we can check the values of two expressions and generate the answer as true or false now if you really use these operators in to generate the value how the value will be output we write printf answer is equal to percentage d percentage d stands for printer integer value and we write suppose a into b now in this case a into b will be evaluated in our case it will be 50 and that will be output at the place of percentage d hence the output shown will be answer is equal to 50 now if you use a relational expression what the output will be let's see this line answer equal to percentage d here I'm writing a less than b. Now again, a less than b is a relation operator, so we'll generate answer as true or false, that is 1 or 0. In our case, a less than b is true, that is 1. Hence, the output of this will be answer is equal to 1. So if you output a value of relation operator, it will be either 1 or 0. Thank you.